that can deliver on the promise of what network marketing industry can deliver. I was about a few days ago, this my, my, my friend here asked me, he said, can I ever leave network marketing? What did I tell you? <laughs> I'm an ardent network marketer. I can't leave that industry. I didn't come into it by, by accident. I came in consciously. I may not have found a system that they so delivering, but I knew that network marketing remains the best system on earth that can give to all. And I came here, and the vision says, to attain financial independence and economic inclusion for all. That's the language of network marketing. That's the language of what? Network marketing. This went for those, but a lot of times you meet people that have probably stumbled into network marketing before and they have been beaten. They will vow on their life. Never will I hear this in my life again. It's one kind of thing I say. You want to think about Danny? I'm out on Gumi. For those who don't know your father, when you are slided by a horse, you are on a horse and the horse fell you down. What do you do? You run away. <laughs> and then dust yourself and mount your horse again and then you continue your journey this industry has been the best if I have given up many years ago maybe I won't come across everybody I met Baba in, in BRT and I had him just you know craftily telling people about and they were just smoking him hmm. he said Baba come I hope I have some things you are saying come and tell me and then he started talking and talking he said okay I have had enough don't worry I will come to your meeting now, if I've given up on network marketing, I've just seen that day, and I just regard him as one of those who I've, I've, I've chosen in life not to see again in my life. But I know that network marketing is a system. You may not like it, but I want to make people change it. Now, one of the things I found unique about this is that there's a change of paradigm, a change of perspectives, a change of orientation here. So it's a school, number one. When you come to change your ideology, of how you view life. It's a school of life where things are happening in the marketplace is not happening in their body. So we want to create a community of people that have same mind, that have critical thinking, that have intelligent things that we have been talking about today, people that have right minds. You know how things play out in Nigeria, right? You know how politics is played in Nigeria. You know how things happen in the market. But I want to show ambition now. A world where people that are meeting on daily basis are people of right minds. Mm. It's paradise. That's going to be what? Paradise. paradise. That's the possibility I think everyone will deliver. With you and I. So when you are building your network, I want to see beyond bring people, bring people. And that's a language that we don't like to hear. Mm. It's not bring people, bring people. <laughs> Keep on bringing them. Bring them, bring them. <laughs> We are creating a new society of people. Just like we talk about teacher thinkers. I not only replicate myself in every student I've taught. Mm. When you see them, you know that this one passed through somewhere. Mm. Mm. And when they see me anywhere, ah. you see that these are my children. Yes, yes. That was a community I lived in. The whole environment would go on an opera by passing any streets. Mm. But I helped a brother who build a school from crash. Talk before I left him. I have information about two or three communities that we get there now. I always hide hmm. because the noise will be there that Uncle Sam is around. That's the kind of teacher we're talking about. The last school I taught, they keep on begging me up to tomorrow to come back. Luckily for me, I have somebody who was my pastor's wife that is now the current press principal. See, everywhere I turn, I see your handwriting. That's where I turn. And some people don't know I know you very well. So they recommend you to me. Hmm. Can you come back? We are creating a special place for you, for you and your family. He said, I don't want to come back to school again. Hmm. Or I'll build one that I will manage myself. We want to come and consult for you to help you train teachers or train your house master. I can come on that. He, she invited me once. But the other time, I think it was our last time, I, I wasn't, I can't, I was out of, out of legal when she was calling on that time. That's the kind of impact. That's where I saw myself as a 
a teacher thinker. Now imagine yourself as a networker and neighbor, and you are bringing people of like minds into your own family. You are expanding your own network of worthy, sane, mature, intelligent people. When they enter any sector of any industry, what kind of people do you think you will find there? Excellence. That's the word of everybody. Now look at this chart. I know or maybe you got off time, or God didn't talk about something, but I'll just rush through it before I, 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 I close it finally. This chart make a lot of sense to me since I saw it the first day I saw it. This is the paradigm of two people you have in the world. Many of us are passed through or we jump from one side of the other. The other. We are either operating dominantly in one and we are struggling with it. But here we want to have a refined people. Look at that diagram. That's a man trying to talk, work on himself from what he used to be to a better man. And you see the better man in the man. If you look at that image, well, I know that you may not see it very well to understand and interpret what you are seeing here. So he's carrying chisel to chop off from himself things that are weight and trouble to him, that are corruption to him. The upper part is what he has already completed. So he's trying to come out of the nonsense that has been baggages that he has been carrying for years. Those baggages at the back, the, the black vices you are seeing down. He's chopping them off, removing them, because he wants to become what? A better man. Now, to be a better man, he needs to imbibe all those virtues. Truth, integrity, love, discipline, you can talk about them. So you can imagine, by the time this man will finish doing the job on himself, what kind of man will he be? Mm. A transformed man. A God man. There's something that I got to show others earlier, I didn't see it. I was mm. just kind of taking about it. I know we didn't see it. <laughs> so I'll round up with that. You don't look at this in very well. Mm. There are two images there. Did you see it? Yeah. Who did you see there? A beggar. A beggar. Hey. And then? Does it make sense to anybody? Yes. Are you sure it makes sense? Yeah. Did you, are you really sure? Okay. Now listen. Three ways to fail at everything in life. If you don't apply those thinking we talk about today, I can see it here reflecting. Now, complain about everything. Nigeria is bad. Nigeria is terrible. I want to go out. I want to jump back. Nothing is good about Nigeria to some people. Are we in that shoe? Okay. Blame others for your problems. The reason why we are here is because you worry. <laughs> then, finally, never be grateful. Not even for the little things you are seeing, even the breath of your nose tree. Mm -hmm. Now, look at this. Very well, this image. Look at very well. There are two people there, right? Yes. Can you describe the first person? She has no hand. Yeah, But she's hopping. Okay. Somebody has. He has hand. He has leg. He choose to sit down and carry bucket to do what? To beg. But somebody who has no leg, has on crutches, has no money, he's still hopping. What is he hopping? Vegetable. He's now offering hmm. money to a man that is able. Upside down world. Does it make sense now? It doesn't make sense. Does it still make sense? Hmm. <laughs> Does it still make sense to you? Yeah, what do you say? 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 What do you because this person has chosen to, to be what he what to be, be what yeah. to be down. Why this one? Stood People up. with, 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 with deficiency oh, is making effort. Yes. Now that is where we are. We don't want to be complainers. Mm. The world we have found ourselves is the world where people keep on complaining and they are not making effort to change it. They look for who to blame for their failure. They don't have any iota of thinking of solution, not one single one, to help the circumstance they find themselves or others. That is not the story of Ebony. She mm. wants to make a world where we all are providing solutions for whatever problem we find our way, whatever obstacle 
that comes away. When we meet a bridge, you can just tell ourselves that like, when we meet a wall, stand away. You can create a path mm. to walk through it. This is what Ebony is to me. So we are joining us. You have a clear reason why you want to be part of this body. You have a clear definition of what is bringing you into this board. And then, our reason for networking is not because we don't just network like other networking. We want to actually create a large community. You heard them say earlier that when Adeboy was starting the gym, he was telling them where he was going to go. What are we seeing today? Mm. So what are you seeing today mm. about tomorrow? What can you envision? What do you see about your even immediate community? It's not what you are thinking should be today, but can it become? That is the power of the mind. So we want to put it to use and galvanize all the resources we have. And then, luckily, like, beautifully enough, our system that we call network marketing industry is so unique in the fact that it can distribute that wealth equally, yes. sufficiently all around. for everyone to succeed. So far, we have all the virtues intact, being practiced and emulated. Then, standing out of all, is that thing you are seeing at the back there that, that we mentioned. It is called a leverage machine. Mm. More we talk about it. There are about, uh, about major windows there, which I will not want to go into today. So that is what our meetings is for on Wednesdays. When you hear more about what this and how this can translate into financial freedom for us. So we meet every Wednesdays. We have people want to bring along with you. Go home and change their mind, change their perspective, change their life generally. We bring them together on Wednesdays. On Fridays, we meet here to talk about you and I. That's what you are doing already. Because I'm, a, I'm an expert in the school industry, I'll tell you, if you give me 100k, I will turn it around. Mm. You know, I, I, I was in a, a, a handy school recently. That school is about 10 years old now. I have to go and paint that school for her. Mm. And then they are thinking of selling the school off. I called the other said, if you sell the school, I'll be annoying with you. But I see money here mm. that you're not seeing. Mm. If you give me this school within one time, I'll turn it around. If I can turn around many schools for owners, I don't see why you as a who have served others. Mm. So the capacity of a school, 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 school uh, 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 HM, not look at your own school and leave to close down. We start sharing ideas. Man say, I didn't think that in that way, I didn't think in that way, because he wasn't using his thinking for thought. Like Baba said, school is one of the fantastic places to, to begin. And to, to, to try to have the, the nerves to start. Now, that is just about school. What about what you are doing? We are interested in that vision, that dream, that skill, that enterprise that you have chosen. Even if it's too big, you are selling. I can turn that ordinary opportunity mm -hmm. into extraordinary. That is what this place is all about. So on Fridays, we have room of bringing those kind of trouble businesses here for discussion. So we talk about those things in, you know, in a very wider way and see how we can help ourselves to turn around. So that when we launch out back into society, we can do a tremendous business. That is the only way we can change the norm. And change the narratives, the way people have always done it. If you enter a Kurudu market now, you see a lot of things that are done the opposite way. You can write it to your own and change the narrative. So, at this junction, <laughs> things can decide whether it's what is good to be part of this community or this is not where I want to be. Mm -hmm. Choice is yours. Yes. Thank you very much.